good day everyone basically this is a short video to explain a basic function of the exports power sensor and some of its uh, applications up there in the breaker panel is the current transformer clamp in the main AC line this wire goes to the CT input of our EXPS device. Now we have uh, 32 watts of import power. This is a normal situation. So as you can see, the red LED of the export power sensor is off. Now let's see what will happen if the power becomes export. Now as you can see, the power becomes zero and we have a 0.37 amps means this is an export situation. So the red LED of the export power sensor turns on. Now let's see what will happen if the power becomes import again. Now we have an import power again. So let's see what will happen. After a few seconds, the output LED will start to fade out and eventually turn off. Now we are at normal situation again where all the power are input. Let's try once more to export the power. We have a 0 watts reading and a 0.46 amps means we are exporting power. Let's go back to import again and observe the output LED of the export power sensor. After a few seconds, it will start to fade and eventually turn off. Now this is the sample setup I have. This is a 600 watts 24 volts gritty inverter. This is the positive of the solar panel connected to the common terminal. And this other wire connected to the normally closed goes to the input of the gritty inverter. Cross common and normally closed terminal is two pieces of 200 ohms 5 watts resistor connected in parallel. So basically, it's 100 ohms altogether. Now we are at normal situation. So basically, the grid tie inverter is having the full capacity of the solar panel. The output LED is off. The common terminal is connected to the normally closed terminal. Now let's try the export situation. Export is detected so the red LED turns on. 
the relay will switch on so basically the power is passing through this resistor reducing the power going to the grid die inverter after a few seconds it will reconnect to check if there are still export power no export is detected so the grid die inverter is at full power again Here is another application where the normally open terminal is connected to a charge controller. So every time an export is detected, the power going to the grid inverter is reduced, diverting the power to charge the battery. Another application is to activate the load. So every time an excess power is detected, the device can turn on anything such as a water pump or battery charger, therefore utilizing the excess power.